well, I got a comment from um, one of my subscribers, J Dog. He um, said that he didn't think my tractor, my little mower, was um, built to do the trees that I was cutting down yesterday. So, just um, have a look at these blades. So this thing uh, just opens up. Pull that back. Now, so looking at that blade, this is the blades are turning that way. So that's the good side of the blade. I've replaced, re reversed these blades around. So this was probably the first six months. And even that blade there, I can still sharpen that. Now that, I've six months of work chopping down little trees, hidden rocks, or oh, big rocks, all sorts of things, you know. And it's pretty blunt there, but, and it's rounded off. And then this one is just starting to round off. But yesterday cutting those trees, nothing. The only thing that rounds it is the rocks. Trees don't do much to it. I can probably make this a little bit sharper. All you've got to do is um, get a grinder with a flap, flappy paddle on it. I think they're called flappy paddles or flap paddle, um, like abrasive flap paddle on it to make it a little bit sharper, which is better for the grass. So this is a brand new blade. How far does it go back? Oh, this one might, these blades might be bigger. Maybe not. Where's the hole? Oh yeah, that's it. So there you can see the, the new blade underneath. And that one's obviously worn down a lot. But um, yeah, they last a long time. The blades are about $300. Um, but yeah, you do get a lot of use out of them. And like I said, what I'll do now is go get the grinder and put a flappy paddle on it and I'll just sharpen that up a little bit. Now the reason that you want to use a flappy paddle and not a grinding disc is a grinding disc will heat that blade up and heating that blade up is, you don't want to heat the blade up. You're going to destroy the strength of it. So. That's why you use a flappy paddle. It doesn't get hot. All right, I'm going to do that, and then um, we'll have a look at it afterwards. All right, so this is the flappy disc. So it's just got little tiny flaps of um, basically very grit, gritty sandpaper. And we'll come over here. Get that about there. get it a bit sharper like the new one. Nice and sharp now. Yeah. <clears throat> Alright, 
so that's that's that. Oop, let's have another camera. Sharpened up. Um, I sharpened it about as sharp as the new one felt. I've also sharpened that little bit there because that looks like it actually cuts as well. It's like a secondary cut. So that's that done. And now I've got to do the other side. I was just about to say that's done. I've got to do the other side. So this just thing just goes back in. Once again, pull that, pull this out. Doesn't come all the way out because it hits the tire there. Maybe. Haha. -ha. If I turn the tire, I don't know what's going on with the gimbal. And yeah, then you can get it out pretty far. I just need this back over here. Right, that's nice and sharp. Done this bit and that bit. And these things just swivel around, so if you hit something really, really hard, oh, it's a bit hot. Probably got that a bit hot. I can still touch it. Yeah, they sort of, they're just gonna flip back like that, right? But under, have a lovely day. Please subscribe, like the video, comment, do all of it.